Hello and welcome to my This is Total War campaign with the Western Roman Empire in Total War Tala. It's episode 41 and we are being attacked by the Ostrogoths at Syracuse. I'm going to go ahead and fight this manually and I was thinking about showing you this battle but at the same time it feels like one of those defensive siege battles you have seen a couple of times before so I, I decide not to do that but if you do feel like you want to see more of these battles do let me know down in the comments and I'll go ahead and fight this one. Okay so we lost that one we barely forced a mass route but unfortunately their bowmen and hurlers were especially these guys were too much for us so barely made it nearly made it I mean all right so they're going to besiege a Borkum. that's actually good for us I think Augusta Trevororum of course we're not gonna win this but I'm gonna go ahead and do as much damage as I can to get 2600 and let's t have a quick look at the stats here all right so there was an auxilia palatina didn't take did that that much kills but legios serving me very well here and sagittari okay can't expect more and scatacutes managed to get a few flanks and rear charges so we damaged them pretty good. And alright, so Augusta Vindelicorum. And the separatists are helping. Of course, a decisive defeat here, but I honestly moved outside the settlement and went after the separatists. It says they're dead right here, but they have one year there, so I. I'm not sure if we got them. Probably not. It still stands there, so I have this idea that I could take care of the civil war while going down. So yeah, the Huns are making another effort, but they're besieging. Not sure how we're going to go about that, but we'll figure it out. Alright, Macedonia moving for Taredum. They are besieging Leptismania, so we'll be forced to do what we can with in Tripolitano with Triarius right there. And we will also be forced to do what we can here, as I suspected. God damn it, so I'm actually gonna fight this one. I mean three is it yeah, three battles in a row that I haven't showed you guys, so The reason why I'm going for this one because we have five units here and a lot of them are hunting bows. Uh, so but at the same time it yeah, it this shouldn't be possible. But hopefully we could surprise them. It would feel very good with a win here. Yeah, let's. No, let's just you know what. Put that there and move over here. I know this that this is our absolutely best opportunity, but I don't like that. Okay, they're turning. Don't want them to go around course and we do have the Western Auxilia Palatina and they can hold out for quite some time so and we'll place you guys right here we are heavily outnumbered the enemy has been sighted you 
you're going towards this direction. That if he's the only one going across, that's a good thing, but I don't know. I was hoping for way too much right there. I think I'll need you a bit further to the front. Somewhere around here. But as we have seen now, the panic bows are. they're really strong. Yeah, go into Studo and you start moving up here. Something like that. And where are you? I'll bring every one of you right in here. They don't have much strong units like this. They have that Germanic warband that's quite damaged and same with the Step Tribes people. The other guys are mostly Comitatensis, but earlier battles have shown that you shouldn't er underestimate those. Especially they're not that easy to to break. And I know that's their thing. To hold will be able to hold a line for some time, but it's make it it makes it difficult to face them because you're kind of relying on a rear charge with the cavalry to and break a unit quickly. But that doesn't really work as well. That uh, doesn't really work that well. Just because they're, they take too long, it takes too long to break a unit, and the other ones usually catch up by then. So, where the fuck are you going? I need to think. We're thinking we maybe we should move our cav across. Just to tell them that, that we're here, come and get us. Don't want you to move around. So please turn back to into the side right now. Where are you? Yeah, so now they're turning. And that's our cue. You need to move now, so the other ones can reform their lines. As I said, even if we lose here, I don't think they will burn it down though. I haven't experienced that Illyria is that kind of a faction. They usually occupy, so so I think, but most likely they will just sack it. I would I would be surprised if they do anything else. And you just fire it well. They are trying to take out our general. Defend him. Hopefully they just waste their ammo here, but they can fire from quite a close distance. You know what? Can we move you? Let's move you here so you can get some shots in on them. They lost a few men passing the towers. Yep. You are in raid show. Yeah, that's it. That's good. It doesn't give them a penalty on reloading time or, or firing rate or stuff like that. 
Yeah, it's the whistling shot that does. Can we get a view on the Hans Hanuk soldiers here? Or the Hanuk mercenaries? The fire arrows pouring down from above. Seems like our auxilia is doing a good job. Keep firing on them because they are down to 40. And here comes the competences. There are actually a hell of a lot of competences. They have one like spare unit right there. Didn't go for that watchtower over there. See if we could get real close into the action right here. Guess this was one of those end turns. Like in the beginning, where you fight an end turn takes forever. So we're not faring that far into the campaign, but we are already at 41 episodes. But once we reach some some form of consolidation and start limiting faction, it will the speed of the campaign will ramp up quite quickly. Yeah, I can see that. You know what? Start moving your way over there. Only lost 11 men right there. Not a single competitor yet, and he's up to over 100 kills. So, a good start, but we need to do fantastic. Yeah, it really is suicide for Cav to go up against Spears. What the hell are you doing? For fuck's sake. Yeah, I kept firing on those guys. Oh, god damn it. Lost my concentration right there, but it didn't seem to cost me that much. The problem is with... We could take like one or two of these in a melee with the scatter quotes but not too much but they're holding good so far now let's let's give these guys a volley We want to damage them as much as possible. The Auxilia Palatinas. Got a feeling that they were start to drop. Starting to drop, but they're tired, so that's not gonna not that's not gonna work in our advantage. Oh four kills with the Sagittari. Almost 50, we need to do better. Yeah, nice volley right there. Give me more. The whore is burning right there. Just gotta keep him right there. How's there? Yeah, they're actually shattered. So I think it's. Yep, stop. Start moving your way to towards here. 
and we will strike when the time comes. Enemy units have been rallied. 10, 13, so not likely, not likely dead. They have their general to to the front, it seems. I think that's uh, kind of our only hope here. Let's have a look at the front line again. Now we can see those combat tendencies. Battling it out with the Auxilia Palatina. They do have a lot of men, gotta say that. Now, fire on them. Want to get rid of that cab. Keep firing on them. Or move. Move up and see if we could take these guys out. <clears throat> Can we get a vo nice volley to see some kills? Yep, yeah, here the here it comes. The hell precision shot are they standing right on the edge so let's bring you forward a tiny bit more they haven't taken the capture point now let's see. Yeah. One here and there. Stop firing and Should we focus fire on the general maybe? Not yet. We want to continue fire on them. Auxilia Palatina holding the line. 200 kills. I reckon that's basically most cab. So it's the Legio that has to do a tremendous work here. I don't like that you stand so close. You just hold your fire and let them fire on us because I think they maybe they're getting some friendly fire. In the meantime, we are going for a volley towards the middle here. Make sure you don't fire into the backs of the Legios right now. Yep, looks okay. Not too many volleys left. Three in. Okay, so you've done your part. Now. Stop firing. Just gonna check here. Minus 12 morale. That can't stack, stack a morale penalty here, so. You know what? I'll gonna, I'm going to s 
spare your ammo a bit. Or maybe give them a volley. And stand over here. So you're in range. Our men return to the fight. Yeah, that was a good one. Stop now, and you can place yourself right there. It's time to start moving the cab a bit closer. 26, but they do have some ammo left, so... I want them to use up all their ammo. And Legio is looking fine for now, so... Let's not bother with it. 21. It doesn't look like they're getting so much friendly fire. Legios is actually dropping quite quickly. I wonder if that... Yeah, it's that Germanic Warband unit. Can we see them somewhere? 67. So, maybe... Give them one volley of whistling shot. Because that will slow them down a tiny bit at least. one left so we will save it now it's time for you to move on in and see if we could hit the sweet spot yeah but it looks it looks like they are turning away from us They're routing, so let's face them now. They will run away from us. Move this way instead. Yeah, they're shattered, so let's lure, lure them here. Okay, so the general is still here. But no. Oh, we can. Ah, god damn it, we. They got the charge in on us. We will take care of them. Which way are they moving? We could actually break them with a charge, I think. So let's go ahead and look to do that. Just gotta be careful with those spearmen. They are actually going here, so. Breaking the barricade. Yeah. Take them up. Take them down. You should be able to handle it. And yeah, that's good. He's shattered, and he should be even be dead. See if we could take care of them, step tribes people as well. Let's go for it. Let's 
they're weak, so damage dealers, but not strong units in armor or health. So they just, this should be fine. Yeah, that's good. We can't charge in on any of these comet tendencies. And you should start moving away so you don't get caught. Maybe we could reach them, move for a push. Maybe we should do that. You know what? Let's just try to wait as long as possible. Step Spearman. Fuck. This is our chance, I guess, so I'm just going for it here. Uh, he's going for it, so just send them in. We won't be able to do much else. else. God damn it, get your charge right now. I need a perfect charge here. Yeah, they are routing, so move towards those step spearmen. God damn it. Shaken, we need to get one more charge in. Oh, fucking detachment penalty. Yeah, you need to charge them so they don't, don't come back. They're actually moving away, so that's good. Come on, go in and break them. That should be fine. How many units are left? Four. As long as we keep him in good shape, no, 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 they're going for the attack. Form up, I need you to get a nice flank here now. But he's stuck on them. Uh, they, thank God they are not attacking our backs, but it seems like they are moving towards this way, so... Go on, give me, give me a Pyrrhic victory here now. The general is shaken as well. Oh, he's broken. We don't need to kill every one of them. We just need to win keep them from sacking keep them engaged and we're still going for it so go ahead and kill the general now but we still need to have the capacity to charge them to charge the rest of the units if even if we kill the general. Yeah, he's now make sure the general dies. Yeah, he's dead. Alright. So maybe there's hope here now. Make sure you kill him and you guys. You're barely, barely holding on. You, maybe if we could get you down to tired or just winded. Doesn't look like it though. Let's 
So now they are shaken. We actually need to bring the cavalry all the way around now. Very tired, minus one. Come on. Nope. Don't fight, don't use your jabs. Not do not do that. God damn it, was it friendly fire right there? Okay, let's speed up here. So we have an opportunity. They're moving for it. And you need to go around. That's the worst of it. You're actually, your morale is up now when you're only winded. You use all your jabs and Now it's just a matter of him holding on. And he is going to be tired as hell. Send you guys in. No, 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 no. What happened? Ah, oh, shit. Are you kidding me? I totally missed out on that unit. Oh, man. The victory was in our grasp here. We won't be able to hold out on the, against them. Might as well send you in. Oh my god. I can't believe that. I can't believe that just happened. God damn it. God damn it. Let's speed it up. You know what? Can we get some close up and see? How's it looking here? You're active. Unit losing combat even. Yeah. Eighty-six, hundred thirteen, ninety-two, no. Oh man. That's my bad. I need to take full responsibility for that. We did did well so far. Just up on until that point right there. Yeah, what you gonna do? Yeah, we would have needed... This is not enough, I don't think, no. If we were... St would have... Uh, have... If we had a height, a height advantage, that... Maybe, but... A charge with the cab would have broken everyone here. Look at that guy, he stands right over there just like a dickhead. Still combat even though. It's sh a shame that we have that watchtower left. Men 
are losing faith. Our men free the field of battle. This is That's it, Valiant to feed. Yeah, we punished them good, so they don't have the capacity to move on and besiege like Mediolanum or continue plundering and raging in my lands, but I just find it so, I'm so irritated right now. It wasn't like I was totally occupied with micromanaging, so I should have seen that. Alright, Singy, going for the money. Alright, so that's the end of the turn, and I think that will be the end of this episode as well. So if you enjoyed the episode, please leave that like, and if you're new here, or if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel to support me, and I'll see you in the next one.